Hey crafty friends, this is Jenny from CraftJustDummies.com and today I have a haul video for you. Uh, I went to Picktails in Orlando, Florida and um, did a little shopping. I thought I would share it with you just because I'm always interested in what other people pick up when they go shopping on vacation. I thought you might be too. So the first thing I found, actually this was on the um, clearance wall. This is the Blast Off Card Kit from Bow Bunny. It makes eight die cut cards and has the envelopes and an instruction sheet. And look at those cute die cuts. I thought this might be fun to use for um, Operation Right Home. And like I said, it was supposed to be $10 and I got it for five, which I think is a great price. Then, of course, since we were in Orlando, I was doing a little Harry Potter shopping, uh, and I just got two sheets of stickers to put in our smash book of our trip to Universal Studios. Now, because I can't have enough adhesive, I tr thought I would try these um, dots. They are small adhesive dots. You can see they're teeny weeny, about um, a fourth of an inch. And I thought they would be great for just, you know, all kinds of stuff uh, by 3L. Never tried this brand before. Then here, this is something I've never seen before. These are called Wink of Stella brushes. And it has a brush tip like this. It looks to me like it wants to be eyeliner when it grows up. Uh, it's by Kurtaki Zig. And it's supposed to be some kind of a glimmery, sparkly... Um, embellishment pen, maybe like a smooch. I got a black and a green and a purple, and they, these were so new that they hadn't even tried these out at the store yet, so they couldn't demo them for me. So I bought three, thinking, hey, let's try these out for Craft Craft Studies. So we'll do that next. And then um, the store carries a lot of uh, Silhouette Cameo uh, products, so I thought I would get the double-sided adhesive starter kit, and it has some glitter and flocking and double-sided paper. Um, including some images. There's like an image uh, card and a spatula and I thought I would try out that and I actually got some extra adhesive sheets as well. This has um, eight extra sheets in it. So I'll be testing this up for the vlog as well. And then last but not least, new, 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 new. I got these things. Never saw these before. This is, what are they called? They're from mudpuddles.net and can you see in there? They're like these glittery, globby bits and pieces. And let me open this up for you. You can kind of see there. It's, um, I don't know how to explain it. It's like little glass globs in slime. <laughs> uh, and this is little shell bits in slime. And these are more glass bits in slime. And they also have uh, sand in slime. But it's not slime. It's actually an air hardening epoxy type stuff. Um, and what you do is you spread this on your cards or scrapbook pages. And you let it dry. And it looks like sand or beach glass or confetti or whatever. And I got these kind of beachy sea glass type of looking ones to test out. Um, apparently these are made in America uh, from somebody who lives like in Illinois, I think. Uh, never have heard of it before. And those are mud puddles. So that was kind of my fun. Uh, spent under a hundred dollars and uh, I spent it at a local scrapbooking store, which I think is really important. So make sure you support your local businesses or else they won't be there for you. And um, thanks to Picktails for letting me come in and take photos. If you uh, want to, make sure you click over to the link in the comments or description area um, to see all about my visit at Picktails in Orlando, Florida. Thank you so much and have a crafty day.